Yes, uh, those 180 degree turns, either be if you're 5-4 up or 5-4 down, be crucial in the wash up when we finish this game. Down. Again, good squeezing there. And out. 5-4. Temptation play here at the moment. Very well played. Nine six, ten minutes. It seems a lot Head longer, out. Johnny, doesn't it? Nine this first six. game. It's, it's been uh, yes, a well tour. Four game balls. The moment he's looking very focused. It's unlucky. 11-6. On that Into error moment. from Pajares. Tarek Bowman takes a very confident professional first game. Not leaving anything to chance. Home weren't measuring up then. You know, fair play to the fact that he decided to stay back here with his family and just focus on his training and get himself fresh and ready. He's obviously on a mission here and could be a possible dark horse. Down. Hand out. One, two. This event, you never know. He's a very highly seated dark horse, that's for sure. Well, easy. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic stuff. That one was from back of the service box area, but five one. It's just uh, starting to punch holes in the front. It has the most highest respect for moments, tactical ability. <laughs> so, uh, oh, this is uh, Honestly, it's just a 11, very, very good performance here. Game to moment. moment. It really is. Moment leads two games to love. When he plays like this with this amount of focus, you know, it's, it's hugely entertaining to watch and to appreciate the ball control and the, the skill he's got his quirks and his own identity and orthodox play and it is this is unrelenting johnny 20 minutes as well it's quite quick fire too lovely purity Just uh, on the replay there, we missed a little windmill there. Faces uh, moment, or he's waiting for moment in the quarterfinals. Based on what we're seeing here, Joey, you'd have to uh, have your money on moment, which sets up a tantalising possible semi-final with uh, Mohamed El Shabagi's old rival. Eight, two. And uh, if he's playing like this, it just adds a bit more. Two. All credit nice to, to Tarek Moment. Three games to love. 11-6, 11-1, 11-2. Massive contender for this title. He keeps playing squash like that. He'll be under different pressure as the tournament goes on. He's just popped the ball into the crowd. They've got bonkers for it. 28 minutes short of 30 minutes. That is impressive against somebody of Pajaras' physicality. Three love victory for the Viper, the number three seed. Uh, what was the hardest uh, challenge in today's match? Uh, definitely the first game. Uh, I know Iker, uh, Iker is a very tough, very, very tough opponent. But I knew he had a couple of tough matches uh, yesterday and the day before. So I wanted to make sure that I make uh, the first game as tough as possible in order to be able to run away with a few points here and there. So uh, first game was a bit tough. And the, the conditions today were pretty hot, so uh, we, we sort of felt it on court. We wanted to uh, 
uh, like I wanted to make the most out of it, and uh, I'm, I'm just very happy to be able to, you know, get the lead in that first game, and from then on, I took charge. Very interesting technique, unorthodox, quirky, very wristy player. Beautiful finish and just set up for the first time. 3 2. See the beast Don't of Alexandria please. just unleashing a little bit of power, and I think that that's he'd be well served in just much around the front. El Hamami, he'd be well served trying to press some situations around that mid court area and get onto it quick like that and exactly execute those kind of shots and show a Seven, few tricks eight. because he's got the foot speed and the hand speed to do it. Need to see more of that from him. Down. It's an incredibly Love soft finish eight. there Game after that Shurbagi, Shurbagi short interlude that El Hamami just puts it into the tin. A really bad ending for him. He had a little sort of glimmer of hope there, perhaps, to sneak it. He wants to continue persevering with that shot. I don't know why. But uh, El Shabagi. I'd say it's a percentage shot at all. But Beast, who. It's hard to really take a summary of that first game. It certainly cracked on in duration at 17 minutes, but it's kind of back and forth slightly and a bit of a stroll around. Ahmed El Shabagi, more importantly for him, leads one game to love. Came through some lengthy first and uh, the first and second round encounters. That looked a little dodgy, Joey, as El, Sh El uh, Shabagi's not happy about it. He's, he ball did not seem to come clean out of uh, El Hamami's racket. No, That's be been dealt with. Dealt with it there. Not coming back from and that. And up one. to one. Oh, and there's the reason why. If anybody out there viewing the, the squash please. was wondering why anyone do they want to get it kept, wipe. keep the court, uh, asking for the court wiping, and that's why, because. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, pretty, it's evident. It's anyone, human now as well. Yeah, any, anyone that is going to be sweating heavily, I mean, that could have easily been a hamstring. Put a little bit more work through the ball. Just lifted his hitting intensity, and he's finding good touch on his shots as well. Very nice finish there, just thinking it across the uh, front of the court. Get to Shurbagi. Shurbagi leads to game to love. Tricky customer, Al Hamami, and uh, good defensive player, but now El Shabagi dealing with him nicely in that game. Yeah, I mean he's he's on the on the push now, Mohamed El Shabagi. 31 minutes, two love lead in this last match of the first part of the last 16 here at the Egyptian Open. Certainly no drop off in speed from El Hamami, who's seen some serious work in this tournament in his first two matches already and he's not going to get that one but it's not through a lack of trying that's for sure court service please should crisscross diagonals around the front of the court because that's where shabagi could expose himself if he's not careful yeah i mean i mean that's a lovely shot uh, it's a beautiful shot. I mean, he's got an angle there, and it's tricky. Eight, seven. Within 40 seconds, Johnny. Not even a minute. There we have it. That's a strike. So, Donald Shabagi, he's appealing it. It's a waste of time. It won't be uh, overturned at all. Play review, have any on the stop decision. Yeah, that's going to be a struggle. I'll tell you what, El El Mohamed El Shabagi is not afraid to have a chat with his opponents when they try to pull one on him. And it'll be interesting to see if there's a bit of a chat going on after this. Stroke to Shurbagi, decision upheld. They shake hands here. 
match to Shurbagi. Three games to love. He's just getting a little lecture there, Joe. 11-8, 11 11-4, 11 11-9. Well, <laughs> there you go. There's the ball. He's uh, lifted that quite lovely, beautifully into the crowd for the little ones. Obviously loving that. It's good to hear them all roaring away. 51 minutes, Mohamed Al Shabagi just needing a little bit of a bizarre incident to spur him uh, on for the last bite of El Hamami to seal the hill, as it were. Very lovely victory to book his place into the quarterfinals. Finally, what are your expectations for the coming matches? I'm actually playing uh, Yao in the quarters. Uh, he's, okay. um, he's like a younger brother to me. We uh, live in Bristol, uh, just next block to each other. Uh, he uh, came to Bristol uh, a couple of years ago to train there. And um, I'm, uh, he's, he's, uh, I, he's, as I said, he's a, he's a younger brother to me. And uh, I have- It should uh, be a very exciting match. It competition. should be a very, very exciting match. Yeah. But uh, at the same time, I'm really happy for him to be in the quarters. You know, he has had some great battles to be able to make it here. And uh, he had a great tournament the last event as well. So uh, it would be great to play against each other. It's our second meeting. and. Uh, we practice a lot in Bristol, but I think our match in two days is going to be a bit different than our practice matches there. Best of luck <laughs> and thank you very much and thank congratulations. You. Thank you so much.